Hello, teachers! In this video, I am going to show you how to use CMS on the platform. Firstly, how to create a new teacher's account in CMS. After logging into your sub-admin account, please click the teacher's icon and then click New. The account will become active and you will not be able to change the username or email, so please make sure all the information is accurate. You can upload a teacher's photo or telephone number if you would like to and after filling in any information, please click Save. You will then receive an email with the username and password to the email address that was provided. Secondly, how to create a student's account. Please click the student's icon and then click New. Follow the steps to fill in the information that is needed. The username or email address cannot be changed after creating the student's account, so make sure all the information is accurate. When you have complete the sections please click Save, and an email with the username and password will be sent to the email address that was provided. Please note, to create a student's account, there are two options. One, you can use your own email address to create the student's account, and once you have received the username and password then you can forward it to the student. Two, you can use the student's personal email address and they will receive the username and password to log in. Thirdly, how to create a course. Please click the courses icon and click new, then fill in the course name. You can choose which scheduling system you want to apply for each course for example, one-on-one -on -one is one teacher, one student this booking system means the teacher should open their available time slots in the platform and students will have access to choosing a specific time and date. This feature can only be applied to one-on-one -on -one classes. One-to-many is one teacher, many students this method of booking has fixed schedules. It means students will learn regularly on those specific dates and times. The sub-admin will schedule the classes for the students according to their requirements and availability. This feature can be applied to one-on-one -on -one classes or group classes. This option is recommended and is set as the default option as well. You have the option to give course descriptions and photos, after adding you will click save and the course will be created successfully. You can add lesson materials and activities by yourself by clicking add new unit. Then click Add New Lesson to add more lessons under each unit. Please take note that the files that you create should be in JPG or PNG format. You can click the triangle to move a slide up in order or to adjust the order of the slides, don't forget to click Save, otherwise you will lose the work completed. After completing this, you can add the package that you're going to provide to the students in this course. You can do this by clicking Add New Package, fill in the information of the package, click Add, click Save, and then it will be accessible in the course's icon. You will also need to please click Teachers and add any teachers who have an account in the platform so they may gain access to the course material. After adding the teachers, they will be able to see the course on the teachers page and students will be able to see the teachers on the site. Please click Group to add a student into this course, you can add one student or many students at a time. After creating the group you can choose the course default mode, example, one to many, one teacher, many students and then you may help the students to schedule the classes. First, please click Schedule, select the teacher and the start time, the time slots are available in a 24-hour slot method, so select the hour first, and then choose the minutes. Click OK, then the start time and end time will be added. If you want to change a session duration for any of the classes, you also can type the minute duration here. Select the date of the class and it will appear on the calendar, the choose the start date, how many days the students will learn in that week, select the session that student is going to learn and click add, click apply when you have confirmed the schedule. After creating the accounts for teachers and students in CMS, you can log into the teachers and students accounts to change the password which will be easier for them to remember. Fourthly, how to add packages and schedule class with students. First you click on the course that you have created in CMS. Please click edit in the course information, click add new package to fill in the new package information. Every package that you create in CMS can be used for multiple students. After filling in the information, click add to complete. In one course, you can create a variety of packages for different students. If you want to add the student in a specific course, please click Group then Add Group to fill in the student's information. Here you may add one student or many students at a time, click Add to complete. 
After creating the study group in this course, you can click Schedule to schedule the studying times as discussed with the students. If the student has finished all the sessions in a package, you can click Extend Package to add more sessions. But please take note the session duration of extended packages should be the same as the previous package that the student completed. If the student has not completed the course or would prefer another course, you can delete the course by clicking on the cross to remove the student from that section and add them to another course.